guys, Jeff the Nature Guy, and I am on location today in an incredible place called Craters of the Moon National Park. This place is so cool. Check out the landscape here, and what you're looking at is basically lava fields that have cooled over time. These lava fields were actually uh, 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 developed or created 15,000 to 2,000 years ago. And what's so cool is when you walk around this park, you see so many different forms of lava, from things called splatter cones, to uh, the ripples where you could see where the lava was flowing, to splatters where the lava actually came up. And the cool thing is, this isn't caused by a volcano, it actually is from lava that oozed up through the ground through cracks called fissures. And so it's a little bit different than when you guys think of the typical volcano lava, kind of a neat little thing there. But what's really cool, are places like I'm in right now, this is actually called a lava tube. And what happened is when the lava flowed through this area, it basically flowed underground and created this ceiling above me, kind of like when the ice on a river freezes, how water can still flow underneath it. It's exactly what happened here with hot <laughs> molten lava. And as time went on, that lava essentially stopped flowing and created these caves. And here at the National Park, you're allowed to actually get inside and explore these caves. There's actually stalactites that come down from the ceiling that were actually formed from the lava that was actually dripping off the ceiling in here. How amazing is that? And if you're lucky enough, you might even see some cool species of bats in these caves as well. I am beyond excited. This is one of the coolest places I've ever been. And if you have a chance to come check it out, come and do it. We're in Idaho right now. And uh, like I said, it's unlike anything I've ever seen. Guys, until next time, I'm Jeff the Nature Guy, and we'll see you at the zoo.